Oh, so I'm watching Spider Man, right? Two on with Andrew Garfield. Now, I'm watching it, but I'm thinking he not even a real Spider Man, cause the webs he got, he de he developed them like with like science, so he not even he don't even got the web for real. He said, uh, "How is he a real Spider Man? He ain't no real Spider Man, cause he um." Those ain't his webs, man. See, what's his name? Um, she told McGuire, and I'm saying, my boy. Ask him. He a real spider. This is too like. This is a good movie, but I find the first Spider Man was just it was better for like. It made more sense as Spider Man. You know, so I'm rocking with uh Tobey Maguire. All right, what up, y'all? Welcome back to another video, man. Man, it's nice outside. It's nice outside, and I'm saying we're gonna go out here and hoop. I'm a little sick right now, but that's all right. Uh, I wanted to go to like a movie or a beach or something. But uh, kind of short notice. That's how I go with my friend, but uh, he was pretty busy. So hopefully, well, it's, it's, it's spring, so it should be getting warm pretty soon. Like on a consistent basis, like today is pretty warm. Today is pretty warm. It should, it should feel like that, uh, you know, on a consistent basis. Another thing, bro, I'm gonna wait because this dude like, trimming or whatever. Another thing, bro, I'm asking two things. I'm thinking about cutting my beard, man. I'm sorry, I do got a pretty nice beard, but. I just feel like I'll look cleaner with it, cleaner without it. See ya. My court, real nice out. But yeah, I've been thinking about cutting my beard, and I'm gonna get a, I'm gonna get a face tattoo very soon, man. By this week, by the week, by this, by the end of this week. Hopefully, by, by the beginning of this week. Hopefully, like in the next three days, I can get it and get like a um, what you call it. Uh, a spade, kind of like a king of spade, but not the king of spade. Just a spade, like for good luck and whatnot. I think about getting something above my eye, maybe like dreams or freedom or something like that. Um, and yeah, I might cut this. So we'll see in the next couple of days what happens. Um, but for, like I said, for right now, I'm gonna just hoop for a little bit. I could set it up. So y'all can see, I'm probably set, I'm just set up a little bit. I used to know how to dribble real good. I had intentions to stay at the court for a little while, but hey, bro, I just ain't feeling today, man. My allergies was kind of acting up. I kind of, I took, I, I took some allergy medicine, but it's also hot. My legs are also tired, and I also don't have no energy. And it's like I can barely, I can see, but I just feel like dizzy and lazy. So I ain't gonna kill myself, man. I'm gonna head back to the crib. Um, now. Chevy, Chevy did give me her old phone. Uh, Cause this phone, with this with this phone right here, the bill the bill got too high, so I I can't turn this phone on. No matter what I do, I can't get like a new chip or nothing. It's just it's just locked. So Chevy gave me her phone, and I can have a phone again. I like I said, this phone hasn't been on for years. Like, I mean, not years, my fault, for months. Probably, like actually, a whole year. A year, some change. This phone hasn't been on, so it feels good to turn this phone back, or, or to have a phone, you know. So when I'm out in public, I ain't got to connect to like Xfinity Wi-Fi. You know what I'm saying? I just get on my phone. Um, plus, it's calls I needed to make that I didn't feel like asking people to use their phone. So, 
Uh, later on today, I'm probably walking get this turned on, or probably go to the store and get this turned on. Probably gonna get some ice cream, sit outside, you know. Stray. Come on, man. Come on. Come on. I'm trying to get the cat to come downstairs because I'm finna leave it in the store. We really don't like it, like, roaming around the house, you know, if we're not here, so. We try, we try to put, oh, I said him, her. We don't like her rolling around. I, I'm not gonna chase, I'm too tired, so. I'm gonna walk to the store, you know what I'm saying? Give me a little bit of ice cream, you know? Yeah, man, I'm gonna walk around here, give me some ice cream. You know what I'm saying? Sit on the porch. Uh, I don't even know if you can see me away until I get in the sun. But yeah, um, when I get back, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna ask my dogs. When I get back, I'm gonna ask my people if they know a tattoo artist. Cause like I, said, I gotta go to work tomorrow. If I if I can get it before then, that'd be clutch. I doubt it, but you know that would be good. Other than that, man, um, me and my friend were talking heavy about getting an apartment, and not just talking heavy. I don't even know if we can hear this windy. We just talk about getting an apartment. We're actually working towards it, saving our money. And we was gonna wait a little longer. We was gonna wait till like both of us had 3,000, which is, it's very easy to get 3,000. But um, I'm also trying to get a car right now. Yeah, I'm also, I'm also trying to get a car right now. So honestly, like if I already had a car, it'd be pretty easy. It's gonna take, you know, about two and a half checks, two, three checks. You know, to get through a thousand. I pay. I get paid like at the bare minimum. I get paid a thousand every two weeks. Yeah, that's that's the bare minimum. But if I do show up to work every day, you know, that's at least. If I do show up the the time I'm supposed to show up, and I don't leave early or nothing, my check gonna be about fourteen hundred. So I need to stop playing. Get on. Get back on my grind. Uh. And I, like I said, and I'm down here with my mom until I can afford a car. So hopefully, on this next check, hopefully on this next check, I can make a thousand. Or I can make enough to to get a car. So that's hope for that. You know what I'm saying? So I can get back to my crib. You know, I love Carlisle. It's my city, but. You know what I'm saying? My home is in Harrisburg right now. So I need to get back home to my bed, my room, my space. You know? And we'll be cool. Other than that, man, it feels good to be walking around. You know? It feels good to be walking around. Lights outside. Man, I feel so naked, bro. I ain't got my chain on. I ain't got my jewelry. I ain't got my earrings. Nothing, man. Sorry, so we getting up there, man. Uh, give me a couple months, I'm gonna be back on track. What I really need to do though, is go to the store, get a whole bunch of like white. I need, I need everything. I need some new socks, new boxers, new beaters, new white tees. I need, I need everything. So. Uh, one of these days, I'm going to the store to get that. And it's real, it's real easy to do. Like, stuff don't be expensive. It's just, you know, I feel like it's laziness, really. And, and ain't that funny, though? Like, how you have enough money to get what you want, but for some reason, you don't get it. Like, a tattoo. If somebody wants a tattoo. Somebody, people make enough to get a tattoo every week. But they just don't feel like doing it. And that's how I had to convince myself. Like when I got my first tattoo, or both of my tattoos, I was like, I don't want, I, I was like, for some reason you procrastinate on it. You have enough money to, you have enough money to get it. Um, 
but for some reason you just don't. So, I had to convince myself to just get them. Um, that's how I gotta do with, with the stuff I'm trying to get, man. I need to just, I need to just go to the store and get the stuff I want. Just get it out the way. But anyways, man, we close by the store, so I'm finna go shopping a little bit. I am gonna get some some ice cream, but I do wanna get a couple snacks, you know. Uh, we are gonna get. White Weezy, underrated, underrated, bro. I'm gonna get both of them. Um, I'm gonna get some chips. Y'all got my snizzacks, you know. Like I said, got my snizzacks, man. Finna go to the crib, sit on the porch, man. Just enjoy the weather, man. Uh, days like this, just so beautiful. You gotta just sit down and recognize how blessed you are, man. You get to take, you get to take a deep breath. You're healthy, and you know I'm saying I ain't got no work tonight. I got a job, I got some money at my savings, got some money in my pocket. You know, so life is pretty good right now. So it's a perfect time to just sit on the porch and just be like, man, remember you thought you couldn't get out that little slump you was in? Yeah. You remember a couple months ago, bro, we ain't you ain't had no job. And um And you was like, dang, I don't know. When the next time I make some money, I really don't feel like working. I don't know if I can even get another job. Cause I keep quitting them. You know what I'm saying? You remember that, bro? You remember everything was on a downhill a couple months ago? You ain't had no money, you ain't had no car, you ain't had no motion. And now look, we good. You know what I'm saying? Back on our feet. You ain't know when the next time you was gonna be back on your feet, but hey, that's how I be sometimes, man. You back on your feet. You got your, you got your, you got a job, you got a car. Probably got yourself a girl or some motion, you know. And we good. So sometimes you gotta put your head down. Know it ain't gonna last forever. But even in these moments too, like. Even though everything going good, you on your feet, you gotta be like, hey. You know, a matter of minutes, but. You know what I'm saying? If I stay focused, if I save my money, you know, if I keep the motion motioning, then I'm good. Oh. She's a damn hit. Said, it's super windy, but it's all about, you know what I'm saying? You appreciate being back on your feet right now. Everything cool, but don't forget that you're gonna be back off your feet. You know what I'm saying? So don't be going out, uh, making some wild decisions, man. Don't go to your job fighting people. You know what I'm saying? Cause you, you, you either quit, you get fired, and it's gonna be hard to get back on your feet again. I feel like it's easier to stay on your feet, you know what I'm saying, than to fall off and have to, man, it, it take a while to get back, you know what I'm saying, because you just gotta play catch up, so. We don't wanna be playing catch up, man, so. Find a way to stay on your feet, save your money, keep a job, shit, find another job. I'm glad I'm doing YouTube, you know, so. At some point, this will be my, this will be my primary income. And I don't have to work for nobody. 
and I don't have to work. I don't have to worry about doing what somebody else tell me to do. You know, I could just be on the up. You know, for the rest of my life. So, hey man, keep going, man. All right, y'all. Got my ice cream. Chilling, man. I really meant to get a slushy for real, but dang, that's something to go like some type of like slushy or smoothie. But that's all right. I got my ice cream. I'm gonna just chill out here for a little bit. Let's see what happens next. All right, y'all. Chevelle want me to try. Uh, let me see this thing first. This is some type of Mexican candy, man. Uh, Hello Panda. Mate, G, this is the, you sure this is Mexican candy, man? Yes. You sure it ain't like Chinese candy or something? No. Nope. I'm not seeing nothing on here that says Mexican candy. How you know it's Mexican candy? My friend got it. Yeah? My friend got it. He said it was Mexican candy. Mm -hmm. All right. See. Let's inspect it first. So, it? It's a cockroach inside. No cockroach. Oh. Oh. Not bad. Good. Why the chocolate so juicy? Mm. I rate it. That's seven. Seven point five. No seven. That was alright. Wasn't that good. Wasn't that bad. More good than bad though. Would I eat it again? If I bought it, or well, would I buy it from the store? Probably not, but actually it wasn't that good. <laughs>